Hello and welcome back to a brand new episode of Adam Fishing 2 and today guys we are going to test out our uh, size 1 hook. Um, I want to see how much bigger our fish can get. Last night I was on us testing it out and I'll show you what location I actually saw a difference. Uh, so let's go right ahead. Uh, the thing I wanted to mention is we had a size 0 hook. Okay. And, um, uh, and I guess, uh, oh, tooth 10, tooth 10, one. See in, in, in real life or in other games, their size one is a large hook. Size two is a smaller, one size smaller, size three is one size smaller than that. And size four is very small. Uh, so I don't know if this size zero, size one, two, three, and then size one, like what it is how it goes about in this game but for now i will just call this size one not to be confused with you know the real life size one hook that are a lot bigger uh so for this size we're supposed to get fish from 500 grams to 3 kg whereas before we were only getting up to half a kg so this is going to be very cool to see let's go ahead first of all <clears throat> free fish catch rud uh catch bleak uh wow look at all these quests i was here last night there's nothing but that was right after the uh restart uh catch ripus roach rud the issue is i just cannot i cannot target any of these fish specifically because i just don't know how to i still suck at this game <laughs> so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna actually take this uh daily quest here if I can complete this quest, that will be great. If I cannot, then that is fine too. Um, so let's get right down to business. So the difference <clears throat> in fish sizes I found was on this map at Pro, Pro Toka. And that was using bread. I can't believe it. Bread was getting us actually good sized fish. So how much bread do we have? 83 pieces. Let's go ahead and buy some bread while we're at it. Uh, bread... Let's buy three of these. Perfect, 277. Let's buy two of this. Okay. <clears throat> uh, dough, 50 pieces. I mean, we can try dough. I don't have dough. Perfect. I'm down to 99 silver or whatever the currency is, but that is not to worry because these fish will soon um add to our coffers guys please don't forget to like subscribe and comment below i really appreciate all your support oh wow i never first of all i don't think i've ever been to protoka i don't know how i missed it or maybe i was here and i just ran away this fire is extremely loud environmental sound is very low my god wow oh we cannot walk any further you know, um, playing this game, I've actually daydreamed about myself making a game like this. An open world uh, MMORPG game. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, it'll be so successful. There'll be thousands and tens and hundreds of thousands of players playing it. It'll be a free-to-play game. And basically, it'll be like fishing like this, except it'll be like Fallout games, where it's open world. And um, there'll be different bodies of water, you'll be able to catch different fish there. And uh, there will be safe zones, so there'll be like, uh, you know, random towns uh, where you can go into safe in for safety, you can rent rooms, you can buy homes there. Inside, like, one of the bigger city in this game. I... Uh, oh... Uh, there'll be like a lake and it'll be a very clean lake. You know, there's no radiation in that lake and you'll be able Oh, look at that 315 kg a, a gram. Sorry large cruisin. Yeah, okay, that looks promising Did I go in. Yeah, perfect And you know, I thought of so much that it'll actually take me some time to explain everything but basically when you're going outside to fish uh, there will be wild animals but I think don't want there to be guns and weapons to be in the game. 
Uh, you're gonna have to find different ways to sneak past these monsters. You know, in um, at the boat station, you hear these creepy creatures, you know, shouting out in the background. I absolutely love that. And it'll be creatures like that, but you have to like, um, like, you know, crawl past them. Not crawl past them, but like to sneak past them. And there will be vehicles, there'll be bikes in the game that you have to forage parts to build or... You know, if someone has already found all the parts, they can sell it to you in a part marketplace like we have here in the auction house. And uh, the other thing is, let's say you get caught by one of these monsters. What will it do? Will it rip you up or, you know, so, like there's a lot of thought going into it. Because like I don't want it to be violent, like I said. So there'll have to be another way. Maybe I'll just knock you to the ground and you'll get injured and then, you know, like you got to get a med kit and all that stuff so that'll be annoying something like that I don't know but it'll be just so cool it's it'll, it'll be a fun game and not a tedious or boring game there will be grand of course and uh, yeah <laughs> that's my that's my thought on the game and uh, you know a game I really miss is firefall I don't know if you guys know about that game, but I absolutely loved that game. I supported it in early access when I was there. I even, uh, I bought a $80 founders pack. And, uh, you know, I got a poster. They mailed a poster to me. They mailed a beanie or, or a toque with Firefall emblem on them. And I really supported the team. And um, they were the, <clears throat> the only free to play company so far I've seen. Who did it right so when they were in beta when they were in alpha they never opened the cash shop until the very end and this specifically stated that it's only to test the cash shop to test the prices and all that stuff and uh oh hello i'll just move here and um and this specifically said only items or the only things will be for real life money will be visual items and vehicles and that's it and i had mad respect for that you know like they didn't give you stupid amount of grind just so they could add premium to the market you know it's nothing like that unfortunately the game closed down i don't know why uh but i think the main reason was they kept redoing the entire game they were like, oh, PvP isn't right, let's redo this. Oh, character cost, uh, character leveling is not right, let's do this. And all those years, that's all they did. They just redid the game over and over again. And uh, that just got them nowhere. So. Uh, Luft pump. <laughs> level 13. I mean, she's high, uh, high level. Like, we are level 5 right now. I've played 8.5 hours of this game. Uh, I'm earning 233.33% variance for every catch I do because we put all of our points in uh, in that. There's perks here too. If I put everything in education, it affects the amount of experience. Uh, so if bread doesn't work, let's go ahead and go to Bloodworm. See how that works. Last night I did catch a 1.3 kg cruisian. Um, that was a fight. I really thought I was gonna get spooled, and I'm hoping for this video I can find catch a big fish like that again. And we will try different places as well. I don't know if I'm gonna get the time in this video. There we go. Not big enough, but Ooh, that's a rud. Large Rudd 665 gram. Nice. That's going to make us some money. But 15 kg, there's no way I'm going to be able to, uh, to hit that target. Unless I play for like 5 hours. You know? <laughs> Craziness. Okay, something better. That is to zoom? No, I don't remember anymore. Um, and guys, I'm also thinking 
Wait, what did she catch? A trophy rod? What? Let me ask. Let me ask her. If she is an English speaker. Oh no, I pulled it up, damn it. I'm supposed to exit the chat. Because I just don't know how to uh, go after these. Oh, oh, oh. We got something here. Yes, large rod. Okay, so bloodworm was the answer. Man, she's killing it. Look at that. Trophy rod again. What? And it won't tell me over their heads that like what they were using to catch it. Oh, am I? Oh, I'm right at the peak. So we got to recast again. Uh, but look at that. 600 grams, 315 grams. Definitely a difference here in size. I never saw green colored fish before. Uh, so it's a definite improvement. Uh, yeah, guys, I again, I tried spin fishing as well. Um, it just didn't work. I know I said last video spin fishing just doesn't work on this map. On any of these areas. Unless I'm doing it wrong. But I just couldn't. I couldn't catch anything. Oh, this fish is fighting hard. There we go. What is this? A tench. <gasps> I think this is our very first tench. Oh my god, look how oily it looks. Hey lady, look. I got a tench. That's my very first tench. Look at it. Look at it. Wow, look at her reel. Man, she's got some got some legit stuff there. Uh, we are 2.358 kg out of 15. I don't know if I'll be able to do it. And we are touching the bottom right now. Oh. Oh, is there a fish already? Nice. Okay, yeah, that's a baby golden cruisin. Julio. This lady... <laughs> oh, man. He just pushed us out. He's like, I'm going to fish in this spot. I don't care if I, you know, stand in front of his face. And I'm like, okay, you can come here. I'm a nice guy. And now look, I'm struggling. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, guys. Look at that. Did she get anything? No, she didn't get anything. Uh, so there is some management in this game besides fishing. I know you guys commented on it. Let me just catch this fish. Uh, there are so many fields that I can never s I remember. There's an uh, energy field. But I think when you get bigger rods and reels and hook sizes, it actually takes up energy every time you cast. So it says water level 99 of 100 right now. Food, stamina, rad resistance health is uh, what we have here for our fields and over time they go down but as long as 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 long as i catch a fish that is 800 grams or more i can give it to the doctor and he heals us up all the way and that's why i just don't want to leave this map because uh, this video i really was thinking of going to the next map that is the next step in our adventure, but I'm just too scared. What if the doctor isn't there? I'm going to have to craft my own first aid kits and all the stuff. And uh, that's really hard. There's a lot of grind in order to make these things. Like I remember looking at the crafting board and it just, there's just so much that needs to go in. So I was like, you know what? Through this, I'll just give that guy 800 gram of fish and he will heal me up. Uh, but the results look good. I like this. Like 9 fish and we're already at 3.6 kg out of 5. Like before I used to have 20 of 20 fish and I would be at like 1.2 kg. So it's a definite difference. But also I'm on a map I think I've never fished before. I actually want to try Zayton. Or Searbrook Bronx. 
So maybe after this fish we can go there. Um, I tried on the other maps and I just didn't catch much. So here we go. Man, large rut again. Uh, 4.2 kg. Okay, let's go to Zayton. A bad day when fishing is something something. Wow, look at this dude. Damn, he's loaded. What happened to his hand? Oh, it gets right there. <laughs> he legit brought a chair. That is so funny. But look how beautiful and just happy this game looks. I love it. I just love it. You know, it's... I know I said it a million times, but I really like it. Where it sounds, the idea, it's the post-apocalyptic world. It's just really nice. There we go, there we go. Uh, I had to switch out to bread. I wasn't getting anything on the bloodworm. But I also switched spots. I was casting there and now I'm casting here, closer to where this guy is. So hopefully that makes a difference. Let's see what we can get here. That fish nibbled on it. Look how beautiful it looks. Seriously. I know the graphics are not top notch here, but this looks so lush. I love it. Come on, this guy's catching left and right, and here we are. What's he catching? Large or rough? Oh, finally. Yes! Okay, nothing big. Large silver carp. Cool. Is our bag full? No, not yet. And I'm gonna throw here. I don't care. Let's see. Let's see what happens here. Uh, good enough depth, I guess. Look at his chair moves with him. What? It looks so crisp. I don't know. Game looks a little too good right now. <laughs> Man, I'm enjoying this. Uh, maybe I just wish there were people who spoke English, though. I really wish. Uh, I want to change. White bait, 27 gram. He's catching really tiny fish here. Okay, silver carp at this map not too great i can change uh the baits and try but okay ah back to our uh, bream spot let's see what we can catch here so i came here already uh last night and it just did not work for me i'm still catching small fish and not very much um, so i don't know how i'm gonna do here but for this video, let's just try it out. So uh, we can see this building here. We can see more buildings, trees taking over. We can see a city sort of thingscape there. Power lines, another. I guess that city continues there. Behind us is this weird structure. And it's really cool. Any action here? Let's change it to Bloodworm. Okay, let's give it one more try because uh, one fish and I think we're going to be filled up. Large, 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 345, 430 gram. One, two, three, four. The so four out of 13 fish, this is going to be our 13th. 4 out of 13 fish uh, is 100 grams. Everything else is large, larger than that. So definitely a big difference. And let's see how our earnings are going. Look at that. That's a huge increase in earnings. Look at that. Three, three silver, heck yeah. We're going to sell that. 
53 silver, let's sell that. 4 silver, let's sell that. 47. So we don't have a single fish that was over 800 grams. Unfortunately, I've caught <laughs> bigger fish than that. We are back to 104, guys. I don't know how much I had before. I think I had this much. And we are back to that amount again. And we have boatloads of new bait. Um, so what I'm doing nowadays is I just make mince meat. And then I eventually make a biomass. And just, you know, slowly increasing my reputation. Float rod, handle. Wow, spin. Lure. Triple hook. How do you make triple hook? Tooth one and monofilament. <gasps> Whoa, whoa, monofilament. How do you make monofilament? How do you get monofilament? Not complicated. Do you find monofilament when you are fishing? I don't know because you do find a few different things here. See, so med kit, you need herbal extract and biomass. What is herbal extract? Green algae, red algae, blue algae. See, I have these two. I don't have this blue algae. So this is totally RNG. So I can go on like 100 hours. I don't know. 100 hours before I even get blue algae. Then I'll be... So I'll be screwed. And the only way I can heal myself is that guy over there. Or spending money buying from... Uh... Actually, you know what? Let's check the marketplace. Med kit. Oh, Universal VIB 420. Seriously? Biomass. Oh, look at that. 350. That's pretty cheap. 55. Oh, what the heck was I looking for? Medkit. Yes. Yes, car, fish, spring. Radius Corp. I don't know what this stuff is. A recipes, resources. Aha, blue algae. Minimum price 0. 0.48. Ooh. Why, why the heck not? Let's buy one. Let's craft it. <gasps> yes. Herbal extract. Oh yeah, we gotta, we gotta go here. Alright, guys, we're gonna craft our very first med kit. Oh, I can't wait. Read. Take. Delete. Close. Noise. Okay. We're gonna gain some experience here as well. Create. Nice. Herbal extract. And now, a med kit. Create. Nice. So, we should have... We should have a new med kit. There we go. Med kit 20. Life recovery is 20. Life recovery is 15 from the ones they gave me. My own uh, one is 20. Oh my god, that is so cool, guys. How do you get a bigger fish tank? Ooh, I need to know this. This is so cool. Rentner. Fish. Bag, basket, radius, you know, so. Huh? Guys, how do you get basket, uh, fish nets? I guess you cannot craft them, you have to buy them. Right? Because I don't see fish nets here either. Which means you can only buy fish nets, so that's why no one is selling. Because there's like no point. Oops. It's resources. Recipes, miscellaneous. Extract of experience. Extractant. Ride it to shelter. Oh, look at that. What is this? Durability 100 of 100. Bulba 2. What? What, what's the size of Kolba 2, guys? 
I want to buy this for 85. Oh, heck yeah. I want to buy this if this is, uh, oh, here we go. Uh, weight capacity, 20 kg. Uh, quantity capacity, 50 pieces. So 20 kg max, 50 pieces. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to do that. Anywho, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this quick and short episode looking at larger hook size and their difference. Next episode, I don't know, guys. Next episode might be me just taking the risk and going to Crucian Pond. If I die, I die and game over for me. If I live, I figure stuff out, then uh, we're going to have a lot of fun in Crucian Pond. Anywho, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I will see you in the next one. Until the very next time, guys. Enjoy.